is owner-occupied real estate. And there's a lot of um, terminology and factors that go into it, but it's something that's uh, it's very exciting and not a lot of people know the ins and outs. So I think it's a great topic today and we got a lot of uh, juicy information here. In yeah, podcast. I mean, this is going to be really good because, you know, every business needs a place to operate. Mm -hmm. And not only that, but this is actually probably where most commercial banks love to lend. Correct. They love it if they can lend to you to your primary place of business. And so there's a few things that actually identify something as owner-occupied real estate. Mm -hmm. And yep. what are those things? Yeah, Go no, I, absolutely. I'll, I'll start just kind of very generally. Um, obviously, your, your, main, um, your main place of operations occurs in owner-occupied real estate, but also how much of that real estate you occupy uh, really is something that in the view of the bank is important because it you know, it's going to be the primary uh, repayment source. So as a general rule of thumb, 51% or mo more of the, the raw square footage of the real estate in question is occupied by your main operating yeah. business. And that can include common area. Correct. So if you have like a common um, cafeteria that everybody, the whole building uses, or you have hallways that people use, all that gets to go towards your um percentage of occupancy in your own occupied real estate. And that's actually one of the biggest places. So occupancy square foot percentage needs to be about f above 51%. Mm -hmm. Another thing that I've seen some banks do as well is they'll say, okay, you have to have your primary source of business in there. But if you want us to consider this as owner occupied real estate and you're not 50% of the 51% uh, of the we won't the rely on the other fees, income, right? We cannot rely on any of the rents that you get from the other tenants as income. Right. If you can service the debt, with your own funds, with your own earnings, we'll consider it. Right. That, that's yeah. a good point. So yeah. let's assume you occupy 60%. We're lending to you. Yeah. I'm in the other 40%. The bank wants to know that if the other 40%, me, my business, I go away tomorrow, you didn't need me. You didn't rely on yeah. me to, to make the note because there's no guarantee. I'm not part of the deal. I'm not guaranteeing it. Even if I have a lease, you know, something could happen. The bank wants to know that should you have a tenant, that's icing on the cake. That's great. Yeah. We won't.